Hello everybody, my name is Brody and this is my very first attempt at doing a let's play. Let's hope it goes well. Just got a story. Something I've always wanted to do ever since I was a teenager. Um, one person, well, I'll tell you more after the story. Why stay earthbound when prosperity awaits you in the stars? Come to Halcyon. The only colony on the edge of the frontier, owned and operated by corporations. A trip of ten short years will feel like mere minutes, thanks to the comfort and safety of your very own hibernation chamber. You'll wake up in a perfect society designed to maximize your productivity with guaranteed full employment. With only a minor term of service, you will become the master of your own destiny when you go out of this world to the Halcyon Colony. <laughs> Sounds like a great idea at first time. But everybody ends up in a very bad spot. Yeah, this is meant to be a good thing, but you know, very, very horribly wrong. Ah, Phineas. There's a man of the hour. <sighs> Hundreds of thousands of colonists left to drift out here forever. Just to keep from damaging the board's bottom line. Disgraceful. Alright, intro over. <laughs> That's quicker than I remembered. Alright, so it's my first time ever doing a Let's Play, I should say. I should be making an intro while I'm doing this. So, it was pretty freaking good. I got a plan for my character build, by the way. But yeah, I've always wanted to do Let's Play. It's something I've always watched when I was a kid, or a teenager. Uh, one of my big inspiration was the creatures. You know, people like Ubax, Nova, Kutra, Seamus. People that I've always watched for years. And something I always want to get into, but just didn't have the money for it. Like, it does cost a fair bit to get the stuff started. You know, it depends how good you want your quality to be. Nowadays, like, the best thing is to get is, like, an Elgato, which is, like, costs almost $200 to get, and then you get a good editor, but, hopefully I've got all this stuff now, and my first time attempting at doing something like this. Let's just hope it goes well. Alright, just depends what build I want. Now, last time I did this, this is my second time doing this, but my first time recording this. I always feel better, you know, doing a first playthrough on something I've already known, other than something I don't know. So, but last time I, my last build was pretty much, did mostly melee and handguns, so. This time around, I want to try and put more on. I hope we haven't lost that silver tongue to frostbite. I'm sure we didn't. And maybe leadership. You would have made outpost administrator within a year. Uh, surely I wouldn't. Very much the opposite of me. Alright. That's what I need here. Um, since I put all my stuff onto dialogue and leadership, it might be good to put a little bit more on my range. Let's see. Forget. Hand me like, nope. Nothing for it. Nothing for guns. What if I can see, really? Um. Jeez. Right, persuasion. I guess. Handle bits for a living, huh? Yep. Um, let's go with mail. It's time. <laughs> Alright, what abomination can I make here? Let's go with random. Oh, God. Oh, Jesus Christ. 
<laughs> it's any worse than I imagined. She's all right. Actually, that's quite good. What I got here. Uh, pale as hell. All right, brown sensor. What's this? Put a horizontal. <laughs> Make it wide as possible. Doesn't really do anything, does it? <coughs> now Zoria looks good the way she, he does. No, 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 actually looks perfect. <laughs> Jesus Christ. I'm only like six minutes in this and I've already made a abomination. Absolutely fits it. Ah, what name should I come with? I'm not really that creative, so let's go with... I don't know. Egg. My name's Egg. Um, anything I should add you? Let's bet. Yeah, it looks alright. Can't do anything else, can I? No. Oh, well, good. Let's get things started. Looks to be your lucky day, my friend. That's what you mean by luck. It is. What's your definition of luck? Really? Not likely, bootlickers. <laughs> Initiate skip jump. You got lucky? But yeah, I won't. Here we all start. Terra 2. Where am I now, Vinius? Vinius? Ah, there you are. Wondering what's going on, eh? Bit of yeah. bad news there, I'm afraid. Your colony ship was inexplicably knocked out of skip space. Oh, yeah? To complete its journey at sublight speeds. No kidding. This means that you and every other colonist on Hope have been in suspended animation for... 70 years, give or take. Uh, that's not long. Normally, <laughs> reviving someone after so long leads to some quite horrifying results. It's called explosive cell death, but it's really more of a liquefaction. Something wrong? Oh. No, no. Well, All good. Not to worry. I've pumped your body full of a special concoction I devised to keep you from dying so horrifically. Hopefully at all, but uh, I guess... Well, thanks, Phineas. Unfortunately, I used the last of my chemical supplies, saving you. I know it's a lot to ask, but I must have your help securing more if we're to save the rest of your fellow colonists. I see it done myself, of course, but the boat yeah. has a sizable bounty on my head. Now, my ship is do. inoperative, but I've managed to hire a smuggler to help you out. He'll be... Oh, a smuggler. I in position. Mm -hmm. Good luck. I'm sure it'll be great help. Phineas? Ah! Machine is shit! Where am I going now? That's a great way to start. Dropping me from God knows where. Meet a smuggler that I don't even know. Where the fuck am I going? Yeah, sorry, I do swear on you. Can you hear me? Is this thing working? Yeah, kinda. There you are. Now, uh, where were we? Oh, yes. Mm -hmm. Smuggler. His name is Hawthorne, and he should be waiting for you at the landing site. All right. He's to be your uh, chauffeur, so to speak. Not to worry. I'm told he's a specialist. Dashing gunslinger, one-of-a-kind ship, that sort of thing. You'll like him, I'm sure. 
I've also outfitted you with a simple wireless monitor so I can track your progress. I'll check in with you as soon as you land. Good luck. I'm... all the colonists are counting on you. What a wrong person you chose to put your hands in onto. You put your life into a very much the wrong person. I doubt I'd be any help to anybody here. Uh, looks like it landed. It landed. Yeah, yes. Ah, you've landed. Good. Hawthorne should be close by. Um. What in law's name? Is that him? Oh, yep, that that's idiot. probably him. I told him to plant the beacon and move away, not stand there holding it. Oh well. Yep. No sense in letting his ship go to waste. Oh, he's got a ship. Hawthorne won't mind you. Mind if I do? Better you than the board, huh? <laughs> Not sure I trusted Shit. the fellow. Might have gone after the bounty on my head. Shame about the whole squashing thing. Nah. Where to go? Yeah, no worries. Just a bruise. I'm sure I get over it. Band aid. We can sew him back up. It'd be better in no time. Oh Christ. Oh, I don't think to kill anybody. I don't think I'll be killing anybody that soon. But here comes our first casualty. Great. All right, where are we going? Right down there. Something I've always wanted to do too, because like I'm not the best at speaking. I do mumble a fair bit, and well, I'm not a person that talks a lot. So when you don't talk a lot, your muscles in your mouth don't get used so you get rubbish at speaking so I thought you know why I try my hands off doing less plays and I hope that you know I'll get better at speaking so I hope I do get better at speaking so where are we up to now down here sprats have to worry about no, it's tunnel nearby oh Oh, yeah, man. Is there? Nope. Oh. Oh, yeah, that's nasty buggers. Don't worry. We'll be dealing with you mean soon enough. I don't have to deal with you yet. Oh, yeah. Look away. Shit. Shit, 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 shit. I mean that shit. Easy now. You've Ooh. been frozen for a while. There's <laughs> bound to be unforeseen side effects. That was close. Never got caught there before. I thought I would. I was gonna get chopped to bits. Oh. There we go. Fuck. If only I could prevent that, you know, chop up a high distance. It wasn't going to be a good idea if away, as it didn't end well. There we go. Now I remember how to use that. Hey, you, come here. Yep. What's up? You've tried the best now. <laughs> now try the rest. Spacer's choice. Oh, wow, that stings. Yeah. Hey, Michael. Huh. Yeah. Looks like the bleeding stopped. I owe you one. Hope you don't mind me omitting this little exchange for my report. Spacer's Choice doesn't like us accepting outside help. Well, that's Spacer's Choice. Oh, we're all part of the Spacer's Choice family here. Uh, not mm. that I deserve to be. Can't even deliver a company slogan. We were out on patrol. I saw a marauder camp up in the hills. Thought I could take him. Then my Buzz gun was fired move. right through my side. I mean, what are the odds of that, right? Yeah, that happened. Just barely scraped by with my life. Crawled in here and blocked off the exit with those canisters. That's a smart idea. Well, what are these marauders? Gibbering, flesh-eating, law-breaking, unemployed lunatics with guns. 
Some hull had grounded their spacecraft out in the open. That's a real good way to attract marauders. See those canisters by the entrance? Um, marauders come sniffing around in here. That I can take wasn't them all out with a single me. shot. Not bad, huh? Sure. Hey, give me a gun. Yeah, okay. You look like you know your way around a gun. Got you some sure ammo. Not counting the bullet. You only just met me. Here, you can have my saber too. What makes you think they can trust me? All spacers' choice weapons are now thirty percent less likely to malfunction. You've tried the best. Now try the rest. Spacer's choice. Spacer's choice. Yes, nailed at that time. You good at your job? Where you am I? Hit your head or something? You're in Emerald Vale. Where um, Spacer's choice. Could yeah, be. but that's besides the point. Edgewater's a little ways down. A uh, pretty place in the Vale. Uh, be sure to stop by a provisioners for a can of our famous salt tuna. Well, alright. I probably won't, but. Thanks for, for the recommendations. The Hope? Is that some sort of fancy new drug? Are you with Auntie Cleo or something? Don't take this the wrong way or nothing, but I'm not allowed to fraternize with Cleo workers. Company policy. Alright, I'll leave you be then. Thanks for the gun, though. <clears throat> Shoot this. Ah. Damage my ears! Oh, oh what just happened? Should have warned you. What in the this sounds like he's having a good time. Phoenix. Can't hear it down where he's saying. But I might as well pick all this stuff up. In the future, I think when my hacking gets up, I'm able to use vending machines and able to sell some of the junk I've got. Brats are annoyed. Oh, what's going on here? Oh. Am, I, am I on drugs? Alright, I'll try it. Oh, orders. Where are they? There they are. Oops. Boom. There we go. It's a shot. Don't run at me. It's not a good idea. Okay, let's do everything they got. Hacking is super easy in this game. I like the Fallout games where, you know, you have to upgrade your picking skills. Super easy to do this one. I'm not sure about everybody else, but I was never into the mini games that Fallout did. Fallout picks. I can never get a hand on it and I'll break every pick I get. But, ah, oh, it's an easy way of doing it. Yeah, pick everything else. Alright. Uh, where's the stuff I got? Yep, I know about this. Yep. So I think, yeah, get stuff in your junk. And then you can pretty much sell it to any van machine you got if you upgrade your. I think it was it. Which one was it? I think it's your hacking. Yep, your hacking skills. Then you can sell stuff to van machines. So. Probably my only few tips I'd probably be able to give you is collect as much stuff as you get, if you can. As much as you can handle. And then you can just sell it to vending machines when if you upgrade your hacking skills. Where are we at now? Oh, all more eyes. Should be easy. Oh! <laughs> if the gun didn't kill him, then 
Oh, I would have. There we go. Oh, it's too easy getting these guys. Why didn't nobody bring a gun to a gunfight? Yeah, ducking your head wouldn't help either. Oh, shit. Where did the other guy go? He's like, fell down here somewhere. I don't know where he went. There's that guy, and there's... Where the other... Where did the other guy go? Uh, what the nerf? Shit, I lost him. Oh, there we go. There's another guy, wasn't there? That was the third guy. Um, shit, I lost him. Oh well. I might be able to look later where he went. <laughs>